Music for Charity here everyone and today I'm going to show you <coughs> how to open up the final box song of chapter 1 Pyromania by Kurokak so you can see first you need to unlock the story chapter uh, episode 6 here to read the story after that there will be a brief cutscene the story yet unfinished after that you will be lead to this. There are three locks which require you to uh, unlock the uh, unlock them to be able to in, to go in and challenge the song. Depending on difficulties, the unlock condition will be different. On these two left and right locks, the middle one will still be the same. For the opening, you need to get you see here. The left lock is actually the ranking and the number of songs you need to get that rank. And the right lock is the number of that song you need to get to the specific combo that the game needs. In each and every difficulty, they will have different ways of unlock it. So for opening, you need 3 song A rank, 3 song 200 combo max. For middle, you need 4 song AA rank. In four song 350 combo max. For finale, you need five song S rank and five song with 500 combo max. And for encore, you need five song SS rank, not encore, only finale. Because right now, chapter because chapter one right now only have four finale and it's not enough. And 750 combo for five song max combo for five song. I thought you lot those slots, there will be this and this as well okay so the left lock you can see here there are these seven letters and below that is the shapes along with the plus and the minus in there as well so we can hear the below are the triangle below x is a triangle with minus below k is triangle with a plus m is square with a minus a with a pentagon with a plus u is a hexagon with a minus o is a triangle with a plus and q is the square with a minus so what does these shapes in plus and minus mean well they are actually the codes the first code it seems like it means Kind of like cipher code, I think. So, so the number of the, the size on the shape here will be corresponding to the plus and minus, which you will use the plus and minus as a guide. Plus means you need to move backward that amount of letters, and plus which means you need to move forward to that amount of letter, and that amount of letter will be corresponding to the size of the shape below the letter. So for example, for x, you got triangle and minus, which means you need to move backward three letters, so it's a u. For k, is a minus plus triangle, which means you need to move forward three letters according to the alphabet. If you keep doing this, so on, you get u, n, i, f, o, r, m, which is uniform. For the right lock, you can see here there's a clock with 12 letters 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And inside, and over here, we have the divide 4 dividing it, numbering numbers, along with plus A D A I E E. This is going to get a little bit more complicated. You can see if you divide those four. Uh, equation like says you will get 11 1 7 and, and, and uh, 6 11 1 7 and 6 you take the letter it then count from e to that in the moment where you complete counting like for example here we got we got 4 divided by 4 11 we got 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 this is the 11 number z you keep doing that 
5 divided by 5 is 1, 1 is 8. 28 divided by 4 is 7, 7 is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Or 3 to 4 divided by 9 equals 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we got 0 in here. On the below, we got A, D, A, I, A, E. Well, for this one, you need to count the letters according to the original alphabet and not this one. So A is 1, D is 4, A is 1, I is 10, I is 10, A is 1, and E is 5. And then you take those numbers that you just counted and then use that to this clock. So when you do the same, it could be 11. Combined together, we got 0, 11. And then after that, combining those two codes that you collected on two sides here, you will get uniform 0, 11. Make sure you need to put caps lock on, okay? Oh shoot, it's still too loud. I need to lower my volume down a bit. I my parents sleeping. <laughs> so we here we have result equal automation dot html, and you can see here below the log is shrine report dot xyz slash result, which you need to go to the Internet Explorer or any now mobile web any web browser to type. Shrine B report docs x y z slash ultimate ultimation dot html. After you complete it, you can see on the tab here. See this guy? See this? Record this. That's the code that you need to input in. The final password is record distance. Oh lord, my no, camera is out of focus. I just So, re -tessin. Am I doing this right? And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you unlock Pyromania. And yeah, it's an Incor 15. I really hope I didn't wait anybody in here. How the fuck did I die? Okay, let's try this again. Oh, it's like this about.
Oh, there we go. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the bug. Alright, there's something really wrong with my the key, but I need to check a little bit. 